It's a haul, let's get cozy. This is actually lemonade. I have a hankering for lemonade, what can I say? Hey guys, so I'm sure you've already noticed that I'm not in my usual stomping grounds. Um, there was some loud noises going on outside the window of the room that I usually film in our spare bedroom. And as most of you guys know, I live in the city, so sometimes the car alarms and the jackhammers and the construction noises are you know, there's nothing I can really do about it, but I thought the show must go on. So right now I'm filming in, uh, well obviously you can see my living room back there, but I'm actually sitting in my kitchen, which is why you can hear Biscuit chomping on her cat food over there in the corner. But like I said, the show must go on and I set up down here today because I really wanted to film this Ulta haul. I'm gonna get my bag situated, guys. So not only did I pick up a few things for myself, but I also wanted to do a little bit of holiday shopping for some of my best friends, which is where you guys came in because I actually posted about it on Instagram the day before I went into Ulta. And I was basically like, I need your help. Please give me some recommendations and product suggestions. And you guys helped me out so much. I'm gonna get into that. Ooh, lemonade is sour. And one more exciting little tidbit I wanted to mention before we get started. I actually partnered with Ulta Beauty on their holiday gift guide, and I got the opportunity to pick out a bunch of my personal favorite gift items, and then those products will be appearing on the gifting page on Ulta.com a week from today. Check me out on Ulta.com in a week. Okay guys, so just to kind of set the stage here. So the first person that I was shopping for is one of my best friends, Renee, and we have known each other ever since the first day of kindergarten. Like, we go way back. She's just one of those people that like, we could have fun anywhere, it really doesn't matter. We just end up laughing about nothing for three hours until we have tears streaming down our faces. We're going to scratch! <laughs> chicken. Are you eating my chicken? <laughs> <laughs> And it's always really fun to shop for her gift because she is so creative and artistic and is definitely not afraid to play around with her makeup and experiment with color and things like that. The first thing that I saw when I walked into Ulta was the Urban Decay Vice 3 palette and I thought, perfect! First of all, I love the packaging on this or the box. I guess I just really like what they did with the whole design of it. So it actually comes in a little pouch like this, that's kind of cool. So there is the palette itself and the back is like lime green like that. And this palette I thought it would be perfect for her because there's a lot of really good functional colors in here, like a ton of really nice matte shades and just everyday neutrals, but you also have a bunch of those fun bright colors too, pinks and purples and blues and greens and I have seen her rock a mean blue smoky eye before, so I think she'll really like this. I also wanted to throw in a little something extra, and I use Real Techniques brushes all the time, and I swear by them, so I know that you know they're good quality, and I felt like that would make a good gift. So this is actually the Core Collection, which comes with a detailer brush, a pointed foundation brush, a buffing brush, and then a contour brush. And then my other friend that I was shopping for, Allie, her name is also Allie. You guys helped me out so, so much with her gift because originally I was thinking, okay, she really likes basics, everyday neutral colors, she can wear to work, at the office, things like that. As per your suggestion, I ended up getting her the Lorac Pro palette, which is actually perfect for her when you think about it. So I'm gonna try not to get my fingerprints all over this thing. Ugh. Oh. Look how new it looks. So you guys have seen mine a million times, but this is what it looks like. Just a perfect assortment of everyday functional colors, and I think that this will be perfect for her. And I spent a little too long at the brush display for the IT brushes. They are so unbelievably soft. I picked up a few for myself, but I also wanted to get her this IT brushes for Ulta Your Beautiful Basics three-piece face and eye travel brush set. So this one comes with a liner and brow brush, a powder brush, and a shadow brush. And like I said, I fell pretty hard for these brushes, so I couldn't resist picking up a few for myself. This is the Complexion Powder Brush number 225, and I wish I could just reach out through this camera and just touch your face with this brush. It is so soft. It's like 
touching a cloud. It's amazing. Then I had to really dig around for this one. I finally found the last one that they had in stock. But this is from the Velvet Luxe collection, which is the black brushes that look like this. And this one is the Soft Focus Sculpting Brush. So this one is like a little contouring brush and again, really, really soft. I have kind of gotten out of doing the very harsh contour, but I think that this would be great for a softer contoured look as well. Also, I had to indulge in a few Pacifica products. So you guys know how I am about my lotions in the winter. I am a dry gal. So this is the Pacifica Natural Body Care Tuscan Blood Orange Super Hydrating Hand Cream. The Tuscan Blood Orange scent is my favorite too. I love this in the regular lotion. And because I love the Blood Orange scent so much, I also went ahead and got the Roller Ball too. It just smells so good. It's, it's not too sweet, it's not too citrusy, it's not too, well, it's not really flowery at all. It's just a great scent. I feel like it's really unique, so I wanted to be able to carry this around in my bag. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, it just smells so good. I feel like it smells even better in the rollerball than it does in the lotions. Awesome. And I also got one of these Body Shop Body Butter Snow Globes. I kind of just thought it was really cute, but I also thought you could really easily divide this up for gifts. I have so many females in my life as far as family members and, you know, Josh's family and things like that. So I thought that this would be great just to kind of divide these up and throw them in with some gifts. You get the coconut body butter, the shea body butter, moringa, strawberry, and satsuma. Satsuma. Hope I'm saying that right. So lots of butter for your body in here. This is one of the Lorac holiday items. This is the Royal Lip Luster Cream Collection. And I had this in mind for one of my really close friends. And if she's watching this, she probably knows it's for her. <laughs> I may have to go pick up another one for myself. But this comes with a bunch of different colors. And I thought the colors were really pretty. A nude, a cherry red, a warm pink, a hot pink, a pale pink, and a mauve. So pretty much every color you could want. All of the Lorac holiday products are so cute this year because they all look like little, um, the eyeshadow palettes look like little chocolates and stuff like that, little chocolate bars. Yankee Candle Christmas Cookie had to do it. Also just gonna have to do this right now. I also got some mini makeup, which is my favorite part of going shopping is when you get little cute samples of makeup. I'll probably just throw these in with the gifts that I'm giving, but this one is the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara, and then another little sample of the Smashbox. This is one of the Be Legendary Longwear Lip Lacquers in Coral. Very pretty. I gotta speed this up, because it's about to be rush hour, and the cars are getting so loud outside. <laughs> like, I thought it would be quieter down here. It's like, no, I just live in chaos 24-7. So like I said, I did spend a lot of time at the IT Cosmetics display, and I think I was just really intrigued by their products because it's a fairly new brand to me. So I haven't really tried anything. I think I tried one of their concealers maybe before, but besides that, I've never really tried any of their products. And this little palette was just calling to me. So this is the Naturally Pretty Volume 1 Matte. A Lux transforming eyeshadow palette and they do have a another palette out that is a limited edition I think it's a naturally pretty palette for the holidays and I just decided to go with the original and I thought the actual box itself was really really feminine and super cute it's like a felt blush pink packaging and it opens up and it is all gold in there. So I was a little confused about the transforming thing at first, but basically these are all matte shadows. So you can wear them by themselves or you can layer this transforming pearl shadow on top of any of the colors and it'll make it a shimmery pearly finish. So that's cool. It kind of gives you twice the options that you would get with a regular palette. And I'm so excited to try this one. So those are all of the products that I picked out for my besties and for myself from Ulta Beauty. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. And don't forget to check me out on Ulta.com in a week. And I'm pretty excited about that. And I'm in my kitchen, so I'm probably just going to go make some food right now. I think that's pretty much it. I hope you guys are having a great day. I love you guys, and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye! I should put my slippers in the shot. These are the best slippers ever.
Yeah. Are you recording? Yeah. <laughs> We're like triple recording. <laughs> <laughs> I love it! Thank you! <laughs> yes! <laughs> whoop, whoop! <laughs> she likes it! She really likes it! Yay! <laughs> <laughs>